part of why I write is because I don't understand things. So I think the only obvious things were um, not to be too um, directional with the camera, not to be too mechanical the way uh, I would look at things. This film kind of came about because it was coming from this genre of female lovers. That was the, um, the genre trope used in the 70s quite a bit. Uh, if you look at many of the films from that period by Jess Franco or by Just Jekin, um, Jean Roland. But most of the time, um, I was focused more on getting an atmosphere and a general ambience. When I was preparing the film, I interview a lot of young people who were living in the same situation as the characters uh, in order to see what they, they thought, in order to enrich the film with their, uh, their aesthetics, their ways of working, um, and all these layers of, of reality that they could bring. So um, yeah, um, I, I work quite uh, in investigating how they, how, how, what topics they talk about, what are their, their main concerns, all these, all, all these kind of things. Well, I was surprised in a way because it was a generation very different from my generation and in another way very similar because the, the doubts were the same, the, the questions, the big questions, the big doubts, the, ang the anguish was the same. But uh, the panorama and the social uh, landscape was different. So when I was 25 years old, it wasn't the problem that there is now with, uh, with finding a job. I mean, it was, if you wanted to be a doctor, you could end up being a doctor. I mean, it wasn't easy. But nowadays, I think that the landscape, the social landscape is completely different. And if you want to be a photographer, then you end up, um, I don't know, being a a taxi driver or you want to be a, a, an architect and you end up being a, something different. So uh, I think it's, it's, it, is, it is quite, uh, quite different from my, from my time.